So, I received some feedback. It seems all the med students think internal medicine rounds are, quote, aggressively boring. So to spice things up, I thought we could end rounds with a game show quiz. Uh, sir, it's 8 p.m. We're hungry. Okay, speak up when you know the answer. A patient has a potassium of 2.9. Does this patient have hypokalemia? Yes, incorrect. Most likely? Correct. Let's not be too confident in our answers, okay? Next question pertains to the material with which catheters are made. Huh? No, urology. These are peripheral catheters. How peripheral? Peripherally inserted central catheters. Pick lines. Oh, boring. Anyway, the New England Journal of Medicine published a study in which participants were randomly assigned to receive a peripheral catheter made of hydrophobic material, a chlorhexidine-coated catheter, or a catheter made of standard polyurethane. What was the primary outcome of this study? Device failure? Correct. It was a composite of infectious or non-infectious complications severe enough to cause cessation of PIC function or its removal. Oh, okay. Well, is there anything else we can do? The incidence of device failure was significantly lower from a statistical standpoint in which group? Hydrophobic? Nope. Chlorhexidine? Uh-uh. Then it must be polyurethane. Wrong again. The risk of device failure was not lower with hydrophobic or chlorhexidine when compared to standard polyurethane. <laughs> We're having fun now, aren't we?